welcome to a creative sim. And this is actually a creative sim that you guys asked for because this is Samoa Scout, who if you're out of the loop or if you're new here or whatever, Samoa is an idea that came to be in my collab video with New Game Minus. And um, I don't know, we were talking about Girl Scout cookies. I know, random conversation topics. But then I was like, five likes on this video and I'll make Samoa Scout. And it was supposed to be 10 likes and I'd make her cat Thin Min, but that didn't happen. So maybe Thin Min will come later because I really like the idea of a cat named Thin Min. But for now, we just have Samoa. And here she is coming together. When I made her, I really struggled with how I wanted to approach turning a cookie into a sim. Because there are so many ways you could do it. I could have done the cookie's personality, the cookie's aesthetic, like the colors and stuff. There's just a lot. And I also really struggle with not turning her into a Girl Scout, but she still kind of has those qualities. But in the end, I thought it would be easiest and it would look best if I turned or if I made her a cookie personality, kind of. I don't know. So what I did was I kind of thought like Samoa's, it's chocolate and caramel and coconut and just sugary goodness, obviously. And so I kind of tried to figure out a personality around that. And the personality I came with, she's cheerful and she's outgoing and she really likes people but she's not oh what's the word for it I don't know she's not like trying to put herself out there if that makes sense she's kind of quiet and she's cute without really trying to be cute so a lot of her outfits she likes to wear a lot of nude colors a lot of whites and she doesn't have she's not very flashy she's not a lot of makeup not a lot of accessories she's kind of there and everyone she's that person that everyone's like oh, you're so cute and she's like ah, thank you but she didn't really try she didn't do anything she just got dressed that kind of thing and I really like her like when I was making her I was like oh no she's too plain no one's gonna like her but I really like her I think it's good that she's plain because I do make sims that have like so much going on like they have every accessory possible they've got full face of makeup to match their style and everything but she's just kind of hanging out and i like it i don't know tell me what you think of that i think it's great but yeah there were times when i was like like i had a picture of the cookie pulled up on my phone for some reason i would just keep looking at it like that would somehow inspire me as to how i should dress her i don't know i really wanted her to have like some caramel brown brown caramel brown hair but I didn't really have any hair with that color. And so I kind of went with this deeper red. And I like, I think that works. And then I gave her kind of silver eyes because coconut is white. And I, I didn't want to give her white eyes. That'd be terrifying. But so I gave her like some silvery eyes. And then just nude and white colored. Except for her outfit. Her first outfit does, does end up having black in it. But from there, a lot of it is um, nude colors pastel colors and whites and I love that and I'm sorry if you can hear my cats being maniacs in the background they're just living their dream right now and I'm not gonna stop them <laughs> yeah her um it was really hard because I intended originally to go like do some cc shopping before I made her to kind of like pull her style together a little more in my mind but I didn't end up doing that and so I was working with what I already had downloaded and what's already in the game and there were so many things I was like, ooh, let's do this. And then I wanted it to be in a green or some other color. And I was like, no, this doesn't match Samoa. This isn't, that's not how she is. I don't know. I picture her, like, if you end up, I'm going to upload her eventually, but I need to get a CC list together. So she'll end up on my Tumblr, like Peppermint and Spearmint did, where I put them and uh, screenshots of all their outfits and then listed every item. I'll do that for her, but that's going to take some time because props to anyone that, like, does look books regularly and posts all the custom content because maybe I just don't keep as good of track of my custom content as I thought I did. Like, I have it really organized into folders, but that took forever to pull together Peppermint and Spearmint's custom content list. But I'll do it. I'll do it for you guys because you guys are great. But anyway... I don't even know. What to, the aspiration I gave her was the one that she wants to be in charge of or part of or whatever, the biggest club in town or something, or the best club, something like that. And I feel like that matches her. Like, she does have some Girl Scout qualities. Like, she's outgoing, and she's 
I didn't give her the, um, oh, it's not overachiever. What is the trait? The ambitious trait. But I feel like she is an ambitious sim. That's always hard for me, too. I don't know if anyone else has this problem. But when you make a sim, you get to pick three traits, right? But don't you, in your mind, develop other understandings of their character? Like, you can't sum up a person in three traits, you know? Maybe that's just me. I don't know. Maybe no one else thinks about The Sims as deeply as I do, but that might just be because I play The Sims more than a person probably should. (laughs) Yeah, I don't know. I, like, put Samoa off because I really didn't know what to do with her, and now I really like her. I do think I made her a little bit too buff. Like, she's kind of jacked. (laughs) She clearly she hasn't eaten as many Girl Scout cookies as the rest of us. Maybe, maybe, oh my gosh, in a world where Samoa Scout is a person, Sam, whatever, do Samoa cookies exist? Like, did her parents name her after the cookie? These are the real questions, I think. And I will leave you to sit with those because the video is almost over. So I'm going to let you go. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I would love to know what you think. And look out for Samoa on my Tumblr. She'll be there eventually. (laughs) I'll see you in the next video. Bye.